Hi, hello, how are you? My name is Nick, aka Loaded Wombat, and you're looking for how to highlight something on Twitch, you know, like save it forever or, you know, bring it over to like YouTube, that kind of stuff. Um, I'm going to show you guys how to do that today. This is a very important skill for you to learn because posting stuff on other platforms is so freaky deaky important. All right. Uh, before you guys jump, before we jump into this video, I'd really appreciate it if you find this helpful for you to like, subscribe, comment. I got tons more videos coming out like this, so make sure yeah yeah do the thing. All right, let's go ahead and jump in and show you guys how to do this and make you the professional streamer that you're gonna be. All right, okay. All right, first things first, you're gonna go to your creator dashboard. If you don't know how to do that, you go to the top right of uh, your, your screen on Twitch, click on your little logo, go to creator dashboard and you'll get end up here, all right? You're gonna go down to content and you're gonna go to video producer. Now, what you're gonna see here uh, next to these videos is something that says highlight, all right? So say we want to highlight something and what a highlight does is it's, it's almost like a clip, but longer. It saves it forever. Um, as you probably know already, your VODs will disappear after a certain amount of days. So you're going to want to go back and do this if you want to save some stuff. All right. So let's go ahead and go to highlight. And this whole menu that you see here, uh, a lot of people find this a little bit confusing. Um, but once, once you get into it, it's really not too bad at all. Uh, you're going to see something that says highlight queue up here. We'll talk about this first. So uh, you can actually create multiple highlights from one uh, from one like highlight that you're doing. So if I add a new highlight, it'll actually bring forth a whole nother um, like a whole nother thing to export, like a whole other highlight to, to export. And it'll put out multiple different files in a way. Right. Or multiple different highlights. So you can you can kind of just chop your whole stream up and do, a, you know, different things. Say you want to just like take it, rip it, put it onto uh, onto YouTube. You can do that. Uh, so how this how this works, you've got your title here. You've got your game section here and then uh, you've got your, your highlight, your add new highlight button here. So as you add new highlights, those will start to add and, you know, all that kind of stuff. We're just going to show you one today. Um, down here, we've got some tools. I don't use these too much to be completely honest with you. Um, but basically you've got, you've got like undo time, timeline action. You got a redo, you got a remove last segment. You've got a split segment at playhead location. And you've got add new segment at the playhead. I don't use those too often to be completely honest with you. Like I said, but, uh, you know, Hey, I mean, maybe you will. Um, you've also got different zoom options here. A lot of times I like to zoom in quite a bit to make sure, especially if it's a longer stream, it's a little bit hard to find some stuff. And on this timeline here, you're seeing, you know, different clips that happened and you can also, uh, also your stream markers that you, uh, can set up, um, and, and put on to like, you know, set a stream marker or, or whatever will show up on here as well. So let's go ahead and, uh, kind of show you how this works. Now what's in the yellow, all right? Very clear on this. What's in the yellow will be end up in your highlight, okay? So you wanna make sure to drag that to a certain spot. Um, a lot of times this dragging here can be a little bit, you know, you're not gonna get your exact spot, especially if you have a longer stream. So you're gonna wanna zoom in, go to that exact spot, boom. And, and you can do it that way. Or you could click like this and say you're just playing through and you, you're watching it, rewatching it back you see something there you want to you want to put down go ahead and go up here to the start segment at playhead um and you can do that there's also a shortcut for that which is alt less than okay alt less than is where that what, what we'll do that as well um and you've got the end one as well so say we want to end it like here and we go boom i just normally click those because i don't really i mean it's really not that big of a deal for a shortcut to be honest. So that's pretty much, uh, that's pretty much what you need, what you do, right? And once you add that new highlight, it's gonna look something like this one here. I unpublished this one, but um, you, if you don't title it, it'll just say highlight and then the, the title that you had for the stream, but you can just title that, boom. And then if you click these three dots on the right, you're gonna see um, edit, add to, download, and you can download that in bada bing, bada boom. You can also export it, um, which will bring forth like for YouTube and stuff like that. But I would just say download it. You know, if you need to edit it any further, you can edit that in a software or you can just put that up onto another spot. 
and that is highlighting. Hopefully this helped you guys out. It is very important to learn this skill because you guys need to be going back into your VODs, getting some of the content that you've uh, you know created live and make it eternal. You know, something that you can look back on, something to be remembered, but also something that people can see on other platforms and then come and watch you live because they don't want to miss it, baby. All right. Again, my name is Nick, AKA Loaded Wombat. I've got this channel. I've also got a second channel called Load Loaded Wombat Creates where I do all of my entertainment based stuff and I uh, would love for you guys to join us over there as well as live on the Twitch. Come say hi and, you know, let me know this was helpful or something. Oh, I love when people do that. So we'll see you guys over on the Twitch as well. All right. So long. Farewell and goodbye.